What did you expect? Devils fans, what did you expect? Did you expect this team to, to win again? You know, we can't string together more than two wins on this whole season. And we have every opportunity to go our way where all the teams ahead of us lost last night. The Capitals, the Flyers, the Red Wings, they all lost. And we needed this win. We had it. We had this very good glimmer of hope that this team could win tonight, be within three points for a playoff spot. But of course, typical Devils fashion this year, they lose a game where they had to win. And, you know, this has been, I know, a lot of games where the Devils had situations where they should win or a must win. But this was one that, with the remaining games of the season where we could have crept back into this, this was a game that really stings because you know the season's over after this. It's been over for a while. But this is one where we could have gotten back into it, but it's it's going to be super hard to get back into it now. The other teams have uh, games in hand, and with those games in hand to close out the year, it's it's going to be tougher to, to gain some spots to close out the year. So this was a tough one. You know, the Devils had a 2 nothing lead. They had a 5-on-3 power play, which, of course, time after time again, this team just passes and passes and passes the puck on the power play instead of putting... A simple puck on net and bang for the rebounds. You know, when you have the extra two men on the ice, it could have helped out, but we just pass it and pass it and pass it and it just goes nowhere. And it kills us because the other team gains some momentum from that, killing that off, and they get back into this game. And that's exactly what happened. Thompson scored, Thompson scored, Thompson scored, and he lost the game. You know, he had a great game. You know, Thompson's had an off year compared to last year, but... You can't give a player like this time and space to score, and he'll bury it every time. Look at that first goal he had. He ripped that shot home. Beautiful second goal. And that third goal, of course, you just had a feeling it was going to be one of those goals to seal this game. And, of course, typical Devils fashion all year, leaving the man wide open in front of the net for just a simple tap-in, and Thompson got his hat-trick goal. You know, Luke Hughes, nowhere around him. He had a really bad game. And this was something that I was kind of hoping you saw it progressing as the game went on. He was making some really bad passes right on the stick to, to the other team. Right on the stick to the other players of the other team. And uh, they were just reading his plays. They were anticipating what he was going to do. They were just reading him all night. Whenever he had the puck at the point, they had a stick right on him and the puck would just go out. Especially on the power play. He was just easily being picked apart tonight. And, you know, after that first assist he had on the Wilman goal... Horrible game. Horrible game. And that's what happened on the last goal. Nowhere near Thompson and wide open just for a simple tap in. And I was kind of hoping that Green would have sat him for a play or two. But, you know, it is what it is. This You know, it's one of those things where, you know, hopefully he, he just really zeroes in on his mistakes this year and corrects it for next year. Because I know he's going to be a sensational player. We all know that. But it's just this year it's been countless mistakes that have cost this team. And tonight was just... A prime example of that. Um, you know, we had the opportunities. Uh, Levi was just sensational in that tonight. You know, robbing players left and right. That last play on Hughes, phenomenal. I thought the Devils couldn't get back into it. There was only a couple of seconds left in the game. But, you know, he made another big save to close out the game. They couldn't solve him on that 5-on-3 power play. And since then, they couldn't score on him. Um, you know, this, this was just a tough game to watch. It really was. It was... A, a game where you kind of had the feeling they could win. You know, the Sabres haven't been that good this year. They're only one point behind us now after the win. But, um, you know, they got a team that's young, that's that's hungry. And, uh, you know, they can score. Their young players can really put the puck in the net. They're, they have a really talented team. And once they figure everything out, they're going to be a scary team with their, with their players in the near future. So keep a look on the Sabres. But th this was just one of those games where... Devils fans were hoping to get the win, and we couldn't. We couldn't get through it. And uh, you know, it's been something we've done a lot this year. We we kind of take our foot off the gas at the wrong time of the game, and the other team gets back into it. And then once they gain that momentum, the Devils have a hard time matching it, and that's when the game just falls apart. So, man, this was a tough one. Uh, it's just somber after this loss. You know, you kind of you kind of. I had a feeling they might be able to get back in it. I know it would have been tough, but to win this game and be three points out, it would have been something that you never know what could happen, you know, especially late in the season. You know, teams go on these streaks where they could take off. They go on these streaks where they just fall apart, and you never know what other teams is going to be like. But, you know, this was a tough one. And I know it's I've been saying that for a lot of these late devil games where, you know, 
Fitzgerald waited too long to make these trades for these goaltenders and you know it's just it was one of these things where we waited too much too long to do stuff and it really bit us in the end and this is going to be a tough end to the season now it's going to be harder because you you know these teams are going to win and get their points necessary to go back in the standings and the Devils are just going to after this game it's going to be tough to climb that mountain but you know the Devils lose this one 5 to 2 it was a tough game to watch I don't know what else to say. It's been one of those trying seasons. Hopefully, the offseason, uh, Fitzgerald addresses things. He has to. You know, he has to at this point or else it's his job too. Uh, so, comment below. What do you think about the game? What do you think about anything? Comment below. Let me know. Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate your time. Smash that like button if you haven't done so and subscribe to Hockey Skate Down. It's free. And join our hockey team. Thank you all so much. Have a great rest of the day. Have a great night. Take it easy. Stay safe.